other than or monthly fees. Shine also helps me grow my savings automatically. My purchases are rounded up and add to my Shine savings account, helping me to save without even thinking about it. And I can even get my paycheck up to two days early with direct deposit. It's banking the way it should be. Start banking with Shine today at Shine.com. I'll be loving the law. And I like the question you have to I just love to learn. You always drive me slow. How did you make so many money? You just wanted to receive money. Do not speed. And that's saving you cash for driving. Yeah, that's a, it's a really safe option. And that's the nicest thing you've ever said to me. You should get all state. Well, all state. We're good drivers stay 40% for avoiding mayhem like me. That's my son's name, Dakota. She tried. You always drive like an old man. Two for six. I think it's so cool that you can mix and match with the impossible offer, the possible offer, the crispy chicken, and even the spicy crispy chicken. You get value. Absolutely. The impossible offer. Now under 2 for 60. You're way, way better. People take amazing photos of things every day. Like, grapefruits. And because we're so good at taking photos, we're also really good at doing taxes. People can be good at anything. Even taxes. And do a turbo tax. Okay. received this this morning. It says, Dear Bumper, I was happy to see you today. I hope that our conversation brought some degree of closure to the grief that you feel. Once again, I apologize for the grief I caused you. Please forgive me, exclamation point. Thank you for expressing your true feelings. Love and miss you. XXX, Dad. Have you seen It's just, I do words. It's him going through the motions, mm-hmm. without motions. He knows the words to say, the words to get paid, the words to get forgiveness, and forgiveness, please. The irony of forgiveness in this situation doesn't mean nothing said in the truth. It doesn't. It doesn't, but forgiveness is letting go. Yeah. So I'm hoping you hear that in this message. I'm sure that wasn't his intent, but that's the message you said. I let go because what you really want to find is hope. Is there hope there? Is there hope? It's no. Any sort of redemption of the relationship or love or acceptance or meeting his approval or validation is all of you. And, and you were right. I, have to, I had to grieve it. And 
I sat in that chair and I grieved and I for a few seconds. I'm just like I've just lost this man. I've lost him. You said that man. It's not a man, is it really? It's your father. Yeah, but I mean, it's a different model to look at to say, oh, that man is a person that's irredeemable. It's never going to change. This is. I lost my father. It's very sad, but God for me, do that anymore. It will always be sad. It will always be sad. You know, not, I don't think we can remove the horrific sadness that this is, but nor should we. That's part of who you are. It doesn't mean that you live in the context. It doesn't mean you live in the fear. It doesn't mean you try to find it somewhere out there. It's always a tragic story. You are affected. You will always be affected. But I don't need to be subject to it. Right, Jack. So what is it that you're feeling at this moment? I'm just feeling a sense of relief. Just relief. I would like to hear to find peace and stillness in his life, to find relationships that have meaning, and to feel good about his life experiences, the things that he's accomplished. Um, I don't think those are too long. I think Collier has made a remarkable response to the, the most horrific of life situations. And I want to certainly continue to commend him on this courageous process. enjoying his golden year. Birds was full of life. He was working on some big dreams or something. Until he encountered a man with a dark side. When we looked into his background, what we found was Pancho. And then, what began as a magical night. Imagine some photos were taken. That's from what he got. That's just so that he wore for what? They can see the smile on her face. And in a nightmare. Her face screen. Oh, that's great, brother. I just think that's it. And the little town was, I think, less than 10,000 people. The house was right in the middle of nothing. And I mentioned to him that I was very concerned about him being so remote. Kirk was a few years, and we had to have a kind of a, a 
safety net there for in case anything happened. Birth still was not the greatest. So I was always worried. 